There's just something satisfying about clipping through the walls in freaking tests of strength. Um... So I was at this one before, right? And I think I saw another shrine over here that wasn't this one. So if I go back here and go to the top of the hill, maybe I'll see the one that I saw earlier? Maybe? I could have sworn there was some other one here. Because at this point, may as well get like two more spirit orbs and then get like two more stamina vessels, maybe? I don't know. I don't know, man. Hmm. So I looked... Which way? That way, right? I mean, I won't be able to see past this freaking rain. We've still got some towers that we haven't explored, but I mean... But I mean... Hmm... I can't see anything right now. Everything is awful. It sucks. Rain, rain, go away. I mean, I could potentially make the rain go away if I find a place where I can set up a fire. Oh yeah, I forgot there was a stable over here that I needed to add to my map. I forgot about that. Gonna go to bed. <laughs> Alrighty. I appreciate you stopping by and hanging out intro. Have a good sleep. Yeah, let's get that added to my map. How about? What's up with all these stumps? Hmm. Hmm. Well, I have no idea where any other shrines could be from there. I mean, that way would be the other towers, right? I have no idea where the one over here is, but I mean. So, since this is a stables, I can get my horse from here. I can. Hmm. Do I still have skew? I'm gonna regret this. Hold on. <laughs> Hold on. I think I just lost my skew doing that. <laughs> Which is probably good because last time I clipped myself into there, I got stuck. Wait, I need arrows! Give me- Talk! Give me arrows. Yeah. Oh, thanks for coming to see me! You appear to have a bladed rhino beetle. Vita loves bladed rhino beals. Would you consider giving it to me? You get something in return, of course. How about I trade you for this meat and rice bowl? I guess that's just a meal? Not even that good. <laughs> I mean, it's all my health right now. Thank you so much. You're even more awesome than I thought you were. I will cherish this beetle that you have given me for the rest of my days. Anyway, back to business. What are you looking for? Sa sa. Uh, give me, like, all your arrows. I think. Wow! Yay! Yay! Um, let's see here. Wow! How many arrows do I have now? 46. We're good for a little while. We're good for a little while, at least. Well. Excuse me! Good sir! I must take out my horse! And if you don't give me my horse, I'll keep spinning like crazy. Uh, take horse. Let's take out opponent here. Apparently there's a quest right here that I could yoink. A quest, you say? Hold on. There's just something fun about like spinning with nothing. Like, you can do this to do a bow spin. What? You can do this to start spinning with your bow and Dang it! I can't even. I can't even do it now. You can hit these buttons to spin with your bow instead and then you can put the bow away and then you just spin on nothing. Because this game is flawless. So, I think we're going up this way. Oh, wait. There was a freaking quest thing, wasn't there? That I was going to yoink. Long ago! Hi. A traveler, tell me. Have you seen a pure white horse anywhere? A long time back, my grandfather told me that he once saw the royal family's white horse grazing on Safula Hill. You see that as a feature, not a flaw. Absolutely. The thing is, just the other day, one of our customers said he saw a white horse on Safula Hill recently. Could it be a relative of the royal family's white horse from my grandfather's day? Well, if you have to see a white horse on your travels, then you could bring it to me. Sure. Thank you. If you see the white horse, please register at a stable and bring it to me. White horse on Safula Hill was supposedly has a beautiful pure white coat without any mottling. I hear it's very elusive though. Good luck. 
I thought it was someone else that had the quest that I saw, though. Was it? Oi! Who needs to be spun at? Nobody? There's no way I still have skew. It's probably good that I don't, because if I tried to clip into that stable, I'd probably wind up regretting it. That's the one that I was looking for. Where'd it go? Right here. Hey, welcome. Is it so obvious? I'm into horses. Like, really into horses. <laughs> and so I got a job at the Stable Association. I'm pushing the fall of Spiltia. The Spilty? Spiltia? I don't even know. I'm so sorry. Which is great and all, but they dispatched me here in the middle of nowhere, which I can handle. But they have me working around the clock. I feel so hazy all the time. If only I could eat some meat for energy. But the Stable Meats are vegetarian for the most part. Uh, what I want to do for some fresh-caught, raw gourmet meat. Do I just give it to you? Hey, you're welcome. But I want to do for some fresh-caught, raw gourmet meat. Oh, that, that aroma. That dog has seen things. You're right. You definitely have meat on you. But I'm really craving raw gourmet meat. Not regular, or even prime meat. It's got to be raw. I'm kind of a weird meat snob like that. Oh. I'm kind of help you. Raw gourmet meat? <laughs> I can do too. The stuff next to the boat is the best. If only I could take a break and go to the Satori mountain area just in front of Hyrule Ridge go hunting. Usually there aren't a ton of animals out there. But every so often, migration hits and it's been teeming with animal life. But I'm never off the clock, so I can't go myself. Anything else? Oh. Thanks for coming by. Let's go! Away we go! Alright, where are we going? I guess we could go, like, get some towers over this way. There should be three towers over that way. I don't know if I can get the one that's in, like, the next most area at the moment. But, I mean, I can certainly try. Let's go do some exploring. Hmm. I see enemies like this, and it always intrigues me. Is this close enough for Master Sword Beam? Give me that chest. Oh my goodness, they have bomb arrows. No, don't shoot my horse. Well, nice miss, nerd. And this is why I should never open my big mouth. And this is why. My goodness. Well, I saved it right before we came up to there anyway, I guess. Uh. Yeah, nice miss. I wish I could use the Master Sword Beam in midair. Oh my goodness, I can. I just don't go into, like, bullet time with it. Bye. Come on. Bye, oh bye. Two practice rounds, I'll say now. Well, I could always use my arrows instead of the Master Swords Beam. This is what I could do. Wait, I have an even dumber idea. As long as I take out that first one. Screw it, I'll even do it now. Oh, oh, I needed freaking jump, don't I, for that. Sorry, it's been a while since I played this game. <sighs> okay, never mind. I'm not gonna freaking send a bomb at him. It's been way too long since I played this. I'm so rusty. Aim's been insulted. They won't fail their, <laughs> fail their aim now. I do like doing dumb ideas, but maybe this time isn't the time for that. I don't know. We shall see here. I mean... What? <sighs> the blade beam range from the Master Sword is like the most pathetic thing ever. It goes like two meters. It's social distancing with COVID-19. That's what the Master Sword is basically like. 
How about you shoot yourself? With it. Do it. I dare you. Or. No, my chest! It's down there. Oh. Oh. My oh my. What's your dog's name? They are gorgeous. Her name's Jesse. Whoa! It's great. Ah, my oh my. And I wasn't actually expecting her to come down at all tonight because, like, most of the family is gone out of the house tonight. So, I figured she'd just, like, stay staring out the window longingly, hoping for everybody to come back. You lived! But she did decide to come down and join me after all. Did it float all the way down the river? Did it sink? It sunk. Well. But yeah, so... That's her spot. That's kind of like her couch there, essentially. And we have a doggo cam specifically for that. As she kind of nods off and stretches like that. She's tired. Oh. Yeah. Oh. We're privileged to have her. What with a doggy cam? It was like almost exactly a year ago that I first got the second camera. And at first I was like, eh, maybe it can be like an overview of like the whole office space. It used to be up there for like me to occasionally show like this entire space if anybody asked about it. But nowadays it's kind of become a dog. What was I searching for anyway? Oh, I was searching for a shield to discard. I, uh, it kind of wound up becoming a doggy cam instead. I haven't used it to look over the office in quite, quite some time now. So good choice. Is it follow for you? Well, I'm glad you like the doggy cam. Yeah, I typically try to do late at night streams when I can. It's been a while since I've streamed since I've been stressed out with a bunch of stuff going on lately, but I'm trying to get back into some more streaming again, back into my schedule, maybe. Perhaps I want these arrows. And when I can, I try to do late night streams like this, because it's only when it's late at night and she's tired as heck that she comes down here and starts... Starts nodding off. Ah, don't worry about it. It'll... It'll all sort itself out soon. Essentially, I need to hear back from my university already about how I can, like, re-enroll in my program so that I can essentially, hopefully soon, n not be kicked out of my university. <laughs> my, oh my. But I don't think I'll be going to my university for this next semester. This next semester is probably going to be a semester of open studies in the trades. And then maybe beginning of next year I can go back to my uni if they reply to my emails already. <laughs> Would be fantastic. Let's go, Apona. So I haven't been streaming for a while. First time in a little bit. But I'm going to try to get back into the, the swing of things again. Starting this weekend. I appreciate that, Spilty. Is it is it Spilty or is it Spiltia? Or is it neither of those? And I'm completely butchering. Butchering that all. I appreciate the warm wishes. From all. There's some stones up there. Some rocks and stuff. Where are we going? I guess we'll go down this path. Spilt tea. Mm. You go by tea. Gotcha, gotcha. I'll call you tea in that case. Gotcha, gotcha. Will do. Is there anything up that mountain that's worthwhile, I wonder? <laughs> we could bomb launch up and find out, but that's also a really bad idea. I'm fairly certain there's a memory over here, but like, do I want to grab them now or do I just want to do them like in order later? I'll just do them like in order. <laughs> In order later. Not that you can remember. Oh, from up there. Last time I played this game seriously was like back when it first came out. I haven't really touched it since then. Apart from late last year, I learned how to speedrun it in like three days. So it was like a worst speedrun you've ever seen. And now it's like my first ever real playthrough of Master Mode using all the freaking <laughs> tricks and techniques I learned from taking three days to learn how to speedrun it after having not touched it for like a year. Yeah, nothing ever goes wrong with bomb launch. Whoops. Exactly. Nothing ever goes wrong with that. Whoops. Oh, I hear Cass. Hi! Bonk! I wanna smack you in your face! Smack him! Smack him! Smack him again! Get off! Bye. Bye, Brittany. Yoink! <laughs> 
You've only got like 95 hours on it, but you've never played master mode? How many hours do I have on this anyway? Friends list. Carby's playing Fire Emblem. 130 apparently. Which like, isn't as many as one would probably think that I'd have when I'm like freaking clipping through walls and doing uh, all sorts of wacky stuff. But yeah. My oh my. Anima T. Look out for the chest. Oh, or just jump over it. I... The horses in this game are not very good. There's a freaking moblin? I'll play it safe like that, I guess. How? Why can't I freaking do this? You always count on you for your late night stream watching because late night stream is the only time that we can have the doggy cam. Oh, that's interesting, isn't it? I probably already have a picture of it since there's one in my inventory, I guess. Yeah, I do. Uh, there was some other weapon that I picked up semi-recently that wasn't this one. Was there? A shield, maybe? Oh, it was a shield. It was like this. Radiant shield. Cool. How are you doing, Sate? Boop. Um, let's see here. How are you doing today or night? To Anima or to me? Whoa! Excuse me, friends. <laughs> Whoa! Hi! I'll just casually freaking scooch on over this way. My goodness, that was certainly something. You got the touch master mode yourself. Plan to play a couple months before Breath of the Wild 2 comes out, possibly on video slash stream. Schnice, schnice. Are you gonna learn any of the th things that I've been doing? Like, you already mentioned that you have done bomb launches in the past, though. But I'm doing alrighty. I'm looking forward to getting back into, like, stream stuff again. It should be a nice stress relief from, like, all the stuff that's going on lately. I do have to spend time working on a few video editing projects that I might be a little bit behind on. And I need to do a whole bunch of organizational stuff for next week's charity tournaments that I'm hosting for the Celiac Society. Where, like, that's just a week away since it's next weekend, so that's crazy to think about. So I'm gonna have to start organizing a whole bunch of stuff real fast when it comes to that and getting a whole bunch of stuff in place i look forward to that and hope that there's a good turnout because i really look forward to this first ever opportunity for me to actually work directly with an org with a charity organization to put an event together so i really hope that it's a success and i gotta like do a lot to prepare for that i guess um but yeah um hi oh i did not hear your approach yeah because i freaking launched myself up this way but dragging out the game and haven't done the last ganon fight because you're trying to drag out the story for breath of the wild too i hate the story of this game i love the gameplay of it i hate the story and music mostly there are parts that i like i have a freaking i spent two months making a three hour discussion on this whole topic on on youtube that i thought would get way more hate than it has but uh there's it's probably still gonna get a whole bunch of hate um passed away several years ago you see and this was the last song you taught me Excuse me, I fear I might have gotten carried away. Nostalgia will do that to a person. I know a song about this place. Would you like to hear the ancient verse passed down in this region? You still have to finish that vid only like an hour and it's an investment oh. just to just to watch that video. Never mind making it. Making it made me never want to do a massive video project like that, like ever again. And now I'm working on one that's probably gonna be two hours long. I'm currently writing the script for it. I'm currently like nearly 40 pages into the script for my next video that I'm working on. And that three hour video was like 60 pages, so it's probably a fair bet that it's probably gonna be at least two hours and I'm gonna hate my life working on that. Mm. Oh man. I semi remember this. I think. I think this was an area that I came to jokingly while I was practicing speedrunning a while back. Like, when I was practicing that speedrun late last year. I was kind of jumping between all these profiles and different save files, and I think... Oh, I think it might have been, like, before I started this series here. I was, like, going around the world making sure that, like, everything was set up and ready to go for this series and stuff. And I think this is an area that I came to. And if I recall from however many months ago that was, I think the spot where you can get an arrow to go through two of these things is, like, somewhere over here. I think. I'm not 100% certain. But yeah, never have the dedication to a scripted video that's over an hour long. Yeah, it, uh, it was certainly something. I think it's one over here, at least. Off the top of my head. Hmm. I thought it was one on the edge, like, inward. 
That was gonna do what's called a gamer moment. What, me? I was pretty sure it was like one of these ones here or something. That or one like way over there. Is this gonna just collide with the... Oh no, it won't. It just kind of clips through. Oh! Ah, come on! Oh, come on! This... Oh my goodness, man. Ha! <laughs> Easy! Oh my goodness. Well, that was a... Uh... Sorry for being loud. <laughs> well... I was dumb. Can I at least pick up some of my arrows, maybe? Can I maybe do that? That would be nice. I figured it was like some set of ones over here. Can I get some arrows, maybe? That would be nice. <laughs> at least there's that. Neat. Well. Well, let's go. I need foods! Dang it, never mind. That beam is so tiny, or so little range, I, I should say. You think I'll take this room. I'll take it, I guess. Do I have a picture of Keese? Surely I do. No, I don't. <laughs> Top 10 photos taken before disaster. Oh, two for one combo. Only at Burger King. I'm sorry, I first... Well, dang it, I was not trying to whistle to you. <laughs> Let's see. I haven't done this all stream, so I kind of want to do it once at least. I still have my skew, right? I just kind of want to do it once for fun, at least. Is this the moment? Nope. Sure isn't, and I probably just lost my lost my skew by doing that. Whoops! Dang. Well, it's easy enough to get back. Easy enough to get back like that anyway. Whoa! And yeah, Jessie's here and she's rather tired. Last try. <laughs> I said last try because that looked like it would be it. Now I'm going to take these and I'm going to try one more time. Otherwise, I'll just like enter it normally, I guess. I guess. That was lame. <laughs> that was rather lame. Was that the slope? Yeah, sure was. Cool. At least it was the slope. Oh, I need like one more frame. Can I? Ooh, I got it. It wasn't enough to get me through. That sucks. Whatever, I'll just go in normally. Looks like I'll keep my skew in case I want it in the shrine. In case I want to clip through any walls facing that away straight forward. Just in case I want that. Hoyle. No clipping into the shrine, but ah well. No. Oh. Can I jump this? What is this puzzle? Oh, it's one of those ones where you have to get it to like the end. Whoops, wrong buttons. Jeez, I'm so rusty at this game. Hmm. Hmm. Hold on a hot second here. I might need a shield that slides on the ground here because the Hylian shield doesn't. I'm also not jumping on the right frame. Oh, come on! <laughs> Get me over this wall, please. War! Oh, don't. No! No! <laughs> Not like this. Are you kidding me? Oh, man. Get me over this wall, please. <laughs> no! Come on! <laughs> this is so lame. This sucks, man. Ow. Well, 
a, a shield that slides a little bit better might be better uh, might be better for the job, but uh oh, we've shown that Hylian shield can do the trick. Oh dang it! I know I can jump this wall. I know I can. I did it before. Oh come on! I think I need a little bit more distance. <laughs> I think is what I need. Oh, I didn't get the right frame. This is literally like a frame perfect trick. Ugh. Ugh. Or at least a few frames. I'm pretty sure it's frame perfect, but don't quote me on that. Maybe it's within a few frames. Ah! <laughs> I can't get over this. Get me over the wall. Oh, my head. <laughs> I can't get over it. Just staring at me. I don't blame her. Ugh. <gasps> ha! Give me that spirit orb. Give it to me this instant. Oh, man. Well... <laughs> We'll continue our quest of doing shrines in unconventional ways. So, I mean... What? What? That's not how the cutscene is supposed to look. <laughs> I guess it's because the gate was down? Because normally, you're supposed to, like, complete the puzzle and get the gate to go up, so it showed the gate and it was like a spirit orb. It's so hilarious to watch Link Ragdoll like that. It really is, though. I should do it in the overworld more, just for fun.